Okay, here it is, the video on my screen printing table. It's a six platen line table that I made at home. If you want to follow the same plans I used, click the link in the description. Sano Shirts in the Philippines did an amazing job at putting these plans together. I purchased all of my supplies in the US for less than $150. Here's a quick glance at the parts list and assembly instructions. Here's a close-up of the brackets and wood screws I used to assemble my table. You can also follow the links in the description below. First, cut all wood to size, then make two notches in piece A. Place piece B into the notches, secure with wood screws. Next, attach the three platen arms, which are pieces C. As of right now, you should have the base of your table created. Next, you will need to add the platen and the guide rail on the top. My platens measured about 13.5 inches by 15 inches. I drew guides on each of my platens. The left chest is 3.5 inches from the left edge and 2.5 inches from the top of the platen. My entire designs line up 2.5 inches down from the top of the platen. Each screen also has a center mark that aligns to the platen. This is so I can line up digital negatives for registration purposes. The following clips will show you the placement of brackets to assemble the baseboards and platens. I used number 10 screws, one inch, to hold the brackets in place. Lastly, align your digital negative on the center marks. To print the registration marks, place a one inch line with a one stroke outline. I use Adobe InDesign. Then align the registration marks to the top and bottom edge of your document and then align to center of document. Also, place your design in the middle of the document as well. You will place tape underneath the digital negative sticking past the edges so when you lay your screen on top, the negative will stick. This ensures your screen and the design are aligned to the board. When you place your shirt center on the platen, your design should always be centered to the platen and the shirt. Leave a comment if you have any additional questions. Thanks for watching and happy printing.